Hey everybody, how's it going out there? It's been a few weeks since I've been able to do a video. I've been really busy, uh, especially cleaning the room. This is like week three and I'm still not done. So I figured I'd sit in between, shoot a couple videos. I was hoping to do a This Just In video, but still waiting on a few things that were supposed to be here Friday and they didn't quite make it. I want to say hello to everybody past subscribers and to the new ones thanks for subscribing keep coming back got a bunch of stuff to show you that being said I'm gonna start out with a couple of promotional things I picked up this came out when the Beatles one album came out in 2000 but it's a Beatles one notepad you know all those cubes But it was just a promotional thing that came out when uh, the album and everything came out. I thought it was kind of cool. And then prior to that, when uh, Red and Blue CDs came out, they did the same thing with that. See? It's the same thing on all four sides. It also came with pens. I have the red one. I haven't been able to locate a blue one. Because I don't see these too often. Then, I got a couple of candles here that were made in Israel. Came out sometime uh, late 80, 80s, early 90s. They're on the limited, limit dead editions. <laughs> Looks like the Grateful Dead skull. But they came out with a couple of Beatle ones. The other one being Magical Mystery Tour. But I can't find a date on them. Can't read it anyway. Then uh, Lionel, the train people, came out with some train cars. And there are six legitimate ones. Uh, every other one you see out there, I don't care what box it's in, it's it's fake. It's a counterfeit. It's a newly made item by somebody else. But the original six, they started out with Meet the Beatles. And the first two came out in the same box. So it was like a two-pack. The thing that gets me with this is if you look at the side of the box, it says Introducing the Beatles. So the first ones that came out, that's exactly what what the boxes said. Then the other one of the two pack was the Beatles' second album. And this one is in the Meet the Beatles box. It's the way it came. But these are the only legitimate ones that are out there, these six that I have. Um, of course, the next one is something new. Then a hard day's night. There's nothing on the back, just the Lionel trademark. So these came out eight years ago already. Now these two were both yellow submarine cars, they're both different. But I don't know if you can tell because of the glare and everything, but the inside of the car actually turns when it's on the track and it's running. The inside part here actually revolves around the inside of the car. But this one's called the aquarium car. And then the hardest one out of all six of them was this one. Actually it was the other one, I got them backwards. But this does the same thing, it revolves around the inside as it's going around the track. But I thought those were cool, but all the other ones that are out there, there's one with a yellow submarine on a flatbed. They're all fake. Doesn't matter, they're all fake. 
See, I'm moving along just a couple of little. It's a beanie baby. It's a uh, Paul the Walrus. <laughs> and they made, don't know why, but a Ringo the Raccoon. We have a Beatles five hole notebook from 1964. There's a few different ones. There's one with three holes. This is the five hole one. They all basically have the same picture on it and everything. But I have the five hole one. And I also have the binded one. But they all, like I said, all the notebooks all have the same pictures on them. And sticking with the school theme since that's what I got. These are also from 64 and these are sealed. They've never been opened, but it's book covers. Love it, huh? Try getting them for 98 cents now. And this is what they look like. I remember in school, we couldn't afford book covers. We used brown paper bags and made our own. And now I'm showing my age. <laughs> I hope everybody that ordered got their McCartney colored vinyl I'm still waiting on mine now it's one of my favorite ones but this is the Beatles air flight case or in other words it's like a hat box that unzips I'm not going to open it there's nothing in it but there's a black one and a red one of these. The red one's a little bit harder to find. But it's really hard to find these without the zippers being replaced already or splits in it or stuff like that. But this one, I have to admit, is in really, really good shape. Still has the original handle, the original everything. But that's one of my one of my favorite pieces I got but I think I'm gonna cut this video a little short because I got a couple more to do thanks for watching anybody out there first time hey hit the subscribe button hang around for a while if you don't like it you know then go from there but I really appreciate all you guys and thanks for watching and until next time